Voters in New Jersey on Tuesday will be casting a ballot in both the Republican and Democratic primaries. As CBS 2's Christine Sloan reports, Democrats control the legislature, but Republicans are hoping to gain ground. New Jersey voters we talked to say even though this is a primary election, they care about the issues. There's a lot of inequality that needs to be addressed systemically. I think the problem with the country right now is that everyone is too far left and everyone is too far right. Democrats have controlled the state legislature in New Jersey for nearly two decades, but Republicans believe this may be their first chance to at least gain control of the assembly. I'm sure that they'll be confident and tell you otherwise, but I'm very confident that that won't be the case. Assemblyman John McKean is former governor and state senator Richard Cody's running mate. Their district's been redrawn and Cody faces Senator Nia Gill in the primary. Cody's spokesperson tells us he's had health issues but is doing better and looks forward to continuing to serve. And I've got every confidence that Governor Cody, based on his reputation, uh, his hard work, uh, his prowess with mental health, will be there for the next four years. In the 26th legislative district, a Republican stronghold, incumbent state senator Joe Panaccio and his challenger bickering over who has the most conservative record. Panaccio says the NRA endorsed him, but that his challenger, a county commissioner, is pretending he's the candidate the organization has endorsed. He didn't say they're endorsing me, but he told everybody what a great uh, NRA supporter he is. I never claimed that the NRA was backing me. The only thing we claimed was that uh, my rating is AQ. In all, only 18 contested legislators legislative primaries, most on the Republican side. Why these races are so heated. In Parsippany, New Jersey, Christine Sloan, CBS 2 News. And because there's no Republican challenger in the Cody and Gill race, the primary winner is expected to take the seat. The primary election is tomorrow. Polls are open from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. If you need to find your polling place, we've got a voter guide on our website, cbsnewyork.com.